everybody, welcome back to Prissy Beauty today. I'm here again with another review and a demo of a new product I've picked up recently. Um, you either see this product on my haul video or whatever. It's a fa you know fairly new finding for me. And it is the Garnier um, Miracle Skin Perfector Daily Eye Roller. And it's a BB cream for the eye, basically. Um, not very different from other ideas that they had before as far as BB, you know, as far as eye rollers and stuff. I'm gonna read to you what it says on, on the box, especially in the front with the claims. It says, number one, corrects dark circles, which can never say enough to me. I've always had issues with dark circles and every time I have something like this, I jump on because I'm a sucker for this stuff. Number two, minimizes puffness. And because it has the little metal roller ball applicator, that naturally helps. Awakens skin, even skin tone, and hydrates, and has haloxyl plus mineral pigments. This comes in two shades. I have I have it in the shade light medium, and the other shade is fair light. So again, doesn't really serve the whole range of of skin tones at all. But if you are on the fair to medium uh, side of the spectrum, then you will be able to use this product. It comes in a tiny tube, it actually, the box is so big compared to the actual size of the product, even though here it says this is the actual size. It's true, if I put it side by side, it is the actual size, but for some reason when you take it out of the box, it seems small. So this is the, the container, let me try to zoom you in a little bit, so you can see that close. So here's the container, it's 0 0.27 fluent ounces or 8 mLs and you open up, you have that typical eye roller and then if you roll it on your hand, sometimes you need to squeeze the tube a little bit for the product to come out and this is the shade on my hand here and you know you can always apply with your hand. So obviously there are multiple products like this in the market. Perhaps they're not called BB cream per se, but there are similar ones. You know, there there are there's the old Garnier version of this, which is that long tube. I used to have it, I don't have it anymore. I recently, uh, not recently, a few months ago, Visible Lift by L'Oreal Paris had come up with that too. So now you have the, the Garnier, but they're calling it a BB cream. So it's to go along with the line of the BB cream for the face that they have. Uh, overall, this product is okay. I, I didn't expect more than what it, I get from this product. I'm wearing it today. You, you can see it provides some coverage, but obviously it's not a full coverage concealer per se, so it's not gonna completely erase your dark circles. You could perhaps use this underneath your concealer just to kind of, you know, hydrate the eye area and then you apply your concealer on top of this. I'm sure you could do that. I try to avoid to put too much product under the eye because for me it ends up looking worse than if I didn't have any product at all because it gets cakey and I don't like it, but people sometimes prefer that way and it's up to you totally. So this uh, retails for, I saw it on Ulta, for $13.49 on Ulta. I mentioned the time, um, I mentioned that comes in two shades. I do have a little demo review or application of this product, so if you're interested in seeing that, stay tuned. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. So I'm doing closer so you can actually see what my under eye area really looks like. And then I'm gonna use the little BB cream for the eye here and show you on one side first what it looks like. Basically applying like a concealer, honestly. Very close to the lower lash line if you want to bring it up to. So here you are, you see, you can see some coverage, but it is not like full coverage, obviously. Let me do the other side. And the little metal ball here on the roller part, it's typical of these products anyway. Uh, you can see there, it makes a little mess around. And you can use a brush for this as well. I just sometimes feel like it's easier with the fingers. It's totally up to, up to you. So here you are. Brought you very close to the actual eye for you to see, because as you know, I don't have. 
I have very dark under eye area. And then let me zoom you out so you could kind of see. I don't have anything else on my face, obviously, only the concealer. And that's it.